Yes, family, we are here in the Gambia and we're on our way to this wonderful processing operation of tie dye and other materials. So, we have a, a good brother here that's going to give us a nice introduction and explain the process and also show what's going on here. Okay, you come closer and see how I do the fatty painting. So this is the man right here. Yes. Gonna explain the, the production. Gambian, that's the Gambian Picasso. You're the Gambian Picasso. Yeah. Hey, if, I don't know much about Picasso, but uh, I like your painting. Thank you. This is this painting. It hey, is you can't take came off. That's what's up. Don't get off the bus or you don't have to pay the kids. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. That's funny, man. Like that. <laughs> once, again, once again, a very warm welcome to the Batik and Tire Factory. And here I am making Batik here with wax. And this one you are seeing in different colors. It was a plain white material. Later I used crayon to make design on it. So after the design, the place I need white to stay, I take a melted wax from here and I will cover those places. So later I'll take the material, dip it inside the collar, with wax, stay white. Without wax, all be the collar. Now I want here to be colored, I'm going to apply the wax there and leave other space for other colors. Normally I do that five times to get five different colors mm. with five layers of wax. So finally I can boil a scream hot water, dip everything in the hot water, the wax melt out, color and the design stays like those ones on the table and that one is hanging over there. See? And now I'll show you, this is, this is called gentian. Mm -hmm. Gentian? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is a local stick with a local uh, iron wire. wire, exactly. We wrap it up and it seems like a container. It keeps the wax inside not to get cold so easy. And it starts to come bit by bit. It's just like when, right now it is very heat. It starts to melt it, you see? Oh yes, I see. see. Normally I use it for thin lines like this. You see? Mm. And I use the brush for the big gap. Uh, boy? Hey. Dakari, Boman. You are going to see the inside for me here. Color inside the line. Yeah, pen by numbers. Don't hold the wire, it is fine. If you are good, you have the chance to stay for holiday job. Yeah. I give you a bit of another one. Yes. <laughs> oh, Bomani. You, you can go. Yeah, right. Five o'clock, you come yeah, and pick yeah, up the Ah, five o'clock? Yeah. Any design? Any yeah. design? He is going to stay and paint with me till tomorrow, 5 o'clock. Ah, okay, cool. Yeah. This is cool. No problem, we need Thank a break. You very much. We need a break. <laughs> we need a break. <laughs> so, from here, we move to the second stage where you will see the tie and die. There ain't no child labor laws here, so we need a break. That's <laughs> <laughs> word. Follow the leader. Okay. Okay. Follow you, brother. Gotcha. Yes, my brother. Hey, man. Appreciate you. Did he get your food? Uh, yeah, yeah, I saw you. Yeah, I saw you. Yeah, I saw you. Sorry, Toby. Mm -hmm. Oh, your brother, did he get his food? Yeah, just yes. Okay. Oh, perfect. I thought you were lost. Oh, yeah, we. Uh, so finished materials. So, all the fancy colors and all these unique things you see. This is the process right here, family. You always hear about tie dye. So several processes to how you get this. Yes. And this is tie and dye. Tie and dye. Uh, so I think that, you know, when it comes to like marketing this kind of stuff in the United States, you create an advertising campaign that uh, markets to a black woman. I have different sizes, different colors with different oh, patterns. beautiful, yeah. And you wash it in the machine wash together with your clothes, 40 degrees, the color space never comes off. It never comes off? Never. Because here, all our colors are natural colors. The red, I get it from the outer skin of mahogany tree. Blue, I use indigo to have blue. Green, I use bokeh green flower. 
two plants mm. in front of me. And sometimes I can mix blue and yellow to have this bottom tree. Right. And for yellow, I take the out cover of yellow onions to have yellow. All these ones are... And these other ones are still with the sea sauce. They have different sizes, different colors with different patterns. Yeah. And these other ones are best seeds with two kilos. They have different sizes, size best seeds. And these ones are big trappers for ladies at the beach. Scarf for the next when it is freezing in Gambia. When it is 27 degrees, by then it is freezing for us. Now you are free to take, uh, now you, are, you can take your time and you look, and in case if you see anything you want, ladies will help you and give you price. So ultimately how long does the whole process take? One like day, two days? It can take three days. Okay. The, the batik one can take like uh, five days with five different colors. Perfect. And now what is this area um, that you have, uh, that you call? This area is called Batik Factory. Batik Factory. Uh, Musuke by Drame, Batik Factory and that factory. Right, so family, this is a manufacturing operation. Now, do you have anything going on in the building? So do you have any kind of production or anything going on in the building or is everything no, outside? Everything is outside. Yeah. I can make shirts with that. Yeah. Is that a yard? Could you, could you make yeah, it look like um, it look like 12 by 36. Yeah. You can make yeah, it does. Yeah. Yeah, then. sorts of trousers, of caftans. It depends what you want to use. It. Yeah. Like you got shirt with shorts to go with it. Yeah. Matching. Yeah. 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 Well, you need one of them just for the shirt, right? For the boy, he can use it. No, I'm saying for me. Ah, oh, for you. Yes, See, you should be able to get two. Yes. And, you can and then one, one, yes. one more for short. Let me ask you later. Maybe this one. Yeah. I don't think that's going to be fine. Yeah, I think ultimately what they do is just... I need two of them to make a set. This one is kind of heavy. Really good material. That's how they, so family, that's how they do it. We see all these unique colors blending all the time. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Jacket is expensive. Then you got to pay for the How much is this? How much is this? This one, you ask the lady. Oh, the lady. Oh, oh, oh. So the lady's managing the yeah. operation. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> we are the <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's the stuff. <laughs> so family, it's beautiful right under the mango trees. Yeah, they all look nice. And all you need to, from there on family when you get some of these materials is a good, you know. Yeah. And it's a good tailor to this, you know. This with the Hook up your design. This with the spring. This with the spring. What is this? What is this? This with the spring. Is this an apron? That's an apron? Oh, I guess they use it to, to wrap. Oh, it's a wrap. Oh, wrap around your waist. It's an apron. Wow. You like this one? And the bed? I like a whole bunch of stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I like a whole bunch of stuff. <laughs> That's nice. I'm under the, you know, under the big tree. Thank you. 
Hey, Mr. Man, Mr. Bomani Dakari. All the children out there waiting for you. Country full of crafts, family. The big issue that you have, family, is you see, the visitors are not here because of the... Yeah? The COVID-19 drama is the best way I can say uh, to avoid any, you know, any of these videos getting a hit. Because you say certain things about COVID-19, you know, it's just in the, the system to where, you know, <laughs> it does something to your videos. Yeah. But the reality of it is, uh, when these things happen, that's why we have to be conscious about what we're dealing with. Because what you're going to have family is... And that's gonna affect us different. Like our brother mentioned it today at the Kachikali crocodile uh, pool. In America and Europe, they have these uh, stimulus and aid packages. But when it comes to like, the Caribbean and African continent, you know, we don't have those same abilities just to print and just throw money out there and do certain things that these people do. That's, that's, that's perfect right there, red, black, and green. And that's all you have to do, family. Get you a good tail and you're in business. Yeah, I'm looking for I got spaces, some are missing. I need to. Okay, okay. Don't you want some, uh, you know, don't you want some uh, materials, Juma? What? So you can get your, your tailor in uh, Cali to just hook you up. And how much uh, is it? How much is it? Just name Is your price. Expensive? Name your price. How much? How much you want to pay? <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, negotiate. Now, how much you want to pay? You give me a number. A hundred dollars. Just down. A hundred dollars. Um, <laughs> I still got to get home. You know, it might cost me a hundred dollars just to get home with a COVID hey, test. Don't you have those things in your your, your, your wallet called a Visa and a Mastercard? You yeah, just gotta well, go to. You tell me they take a Visa card here? Now you go to the money machine. Right. <laughs> I mean, let's pump yeah. out more cash, Look, you know? That's what it's know, called ATM, I automatic. Love my people. <laughs> I would love to be able to help everybody, but I can't deplenish my meager resources um, while I'm trying to help save all of Africa. Right? If I start to do something like that, I might as well go out here and rent me a place and stay here because I won't be able to make it back. <laughs> that's, 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 yeah. a, that's incredible. Yeah, I got to come back with a whole bunch of you guys. I got to come back with a 200, 300, yeah, we're trying to encourage 1 million people. black Americans. There you go. You know, that's to what, invest in the continent and we can all rise together. We yeah, can that's, all yeah, come there you up. Go. America, that's where all the money right. is. They just print it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'll be the treasurer. Yeah. <laughs> and family, we're talking Look, about I'm that. The treasurer. It's a perfect shot right here, family. That's <laughs> <laughs> a perfect. Right. A, yeah. Make me the treasurer. Yeah, the treasurer. In case. So the next thing now is where is all the tailors since you have all of this material? Uh, but there's the, but not so much heat right here. It's just materials. And then I noticed this, this, this separate craft shop. Yes, man. This is this is nice. This is and it's nice and cool also. Yes. Big compound. Yes. family. So, so one is this a family operation? Yes. You know? Yes. We go to uh, uh, um, Musu Kebadran. That she was the one who started the business. She passed away her daughter again. She's her granddaughter. Perfect. Mm. And now they are looking for more people coming. Yes, unfortunately, COVID. Because the, the tourist buses are not coming like they used no. to come like back no. in the days. No. So we would be seeing them processing. Yes. But you know, COVID killed all business. 
But even then, I remember the, the last Roots Festival, I want to say it was like 2010. And then since then, I haven't heard about the Roots Festival. Uh, but the, 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 the guy over the, uh, what's the name again? The, the, um, the curator of the museum was saying that they're preparing a Roots Festival for next year. To put it back in effect, yeah. Because yeah. I remember at one point, it was like, it was called the biannual uh, Roots Festival. Uh, yes. Uh, every uh -huh. two years, they'll do it. Yep. So like 2006, 2008, 2010. Yes, family. So that's it, family. It, you know, just like when you know, there was this Ebola scare in 2014, me and our group was here, and we're like, where's everybody else at? <laughs> so see, family. Let me see. How much is that? Yeah. Like our brother Musa explains, uh, it's which he beautifully explains earlier, that, that the way these things affect us, completely different. In America and Europe, they can print and do certain things and provide stimulus package and aid packages. Uh, but you know, where we are in Africa, or the Caribbean and other places outside of the Western European world, we have to kind of figure out our own problems and work it out. So many people have not business for over a year. Yeah, so you know, that's us family. We're just here trying to motivate the energy and let you know that you're safe, as you can see. No one is dropping dead. Everybody's just kind of ready for you. Oh yeah. <laughs> we call it monkey business in Italy. I really like her and that baby. So how much do you want to pay for this one? He's saying basically name your price. Yeah. <laughs> name your price, family. That's but that means basically everyone is open for negotiation and open to, you know. We call it monkey monkey business. Monkey business. In Gambia. No fixed price. In, in Gambia, only the supermarkets are fixed price. There you go, family. What are right. Negotiation, negotiation. The queen of the world. Can I get a bag? You don't even understand what I'm saying. Two, four, six, eight, ten. One thousand. Hey, I'm just like, I'm just like the Chinese. I understand currency. I may not be able to speak your English, but I understand currency and M O N E Y. That's a universal language, right? Currency, right? Money. Pay me. Currency is survival. Let's put it like that. Don't get it twisted. When you have currency, you have the ability to survive and feed your family. So currency, we're going to redefine that as survival. That's a the piece of that's a piece of paper. Tree, right? That look like a piece of tie and dye paper. Yeah. Give me a bag. The bag's up front. Hey. What do I mean? You gotta hey. count it again? Oh, you're not, hey, One thousand. Hey, you're not in Cali, man. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> we have to get with the culture operation. I watch her because she think like I do. She tell you, I take it, I pay you, I pay you later. <laughs> <laughs> and family, just enjoying a little humor and just enjoying the energy. But this is a big issue that I've seen around both countries, Senegal and the Gambia, where you know, you know, it's usually like buses, bus loads in and out of the country, around the country. And when you have these things happen, and the reason I can speak from experience, because I was, you know, on the content in 2014 when you, know, you hear about this, um, you know, Sierra Leone, Liberian. Uh, Ebola uh, drama and things like that and you know, when we hear these things people run but I want to tell you that you know, I'm always out here always still pushing the energy of what we're doing and it'll take a lot more than people you know, come up with these things to stop us from connecting to Africa yeah, they make a difference. So my quick question. See if she can go to your office. See if she can go to your office. Yeah. Your brother stay prayed up, don't he? Who? Right. He be crucifying that evil spirit inside of all men. <laughs> right? He don't smoke. He don't drink. He just pray constantly. Yeah. You, Abdul. When he ain't trying to twist you for your delosses. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, hilarious, brother. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. He ain't perfect, 
right? He ain't a perfect man, but he be, he be trying, right? Yeah. My sister, do you, have, do you have a lot of visitors coming to buy? Do you have a lot of visitors? Or has business been very slow? Uh -huh. I'm going to check my brother here. How has business been? Since uh, since like last year to this year? Since this uh, corona pandemic, you see everything locked down as no stories, and especially for us here at the Musukeba Drama Batik and Kaina factory, we depend on tourism. So you see all our employees now they stay at home and there is nothing we can do. See family, and that's what I'm trying to explain to uh, um, the people that are going to be watching these videos with us later that when these things happen, uh, you know, it's not like in America and Europe where they print money in this, you know, here it affects us deeply. So that's why I'm always encouraging us to to live through whatever's going on because. Yeah, Ashwanta. Ashwanta. So, so yes, family, this COVID-19 pandemic, pandemic, scandemic, or whatever you want to call it, or like, like I said, COVID-19 drama or situation has really affected the global economy. And so, okay. it's something where we just have to organize ourselves as the people and say, hey, we just got to figure things out for ourselves because we just don't have the same resources to do certain things like other people. Huh? So, we just got to create a better, more organized social economy to fix our issues and our problems and make things work for ourselves. So once again, family, this is Bomani Tema, live on Revolutionary Cam, and just giving you some nice raw, uncut footage, raw and uncut footage. Brother man, I'm good. All right. Yes, my brother. I'm talking about, where's, where's my little... All right, so this one I wanted to show, this is the uh, finished materials. And this is the examples of what you can do with the tie and dye uh, materials, create you know, all kind of clothing.